Hit button on the side or something. <laughs> My fro play. He said, I, I didn't use the camera before. My fro play. Oh, man. Nah, yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I don't got no nerves, but it's a good, uh. Nah, I ain't gonna lie on my way over here. Definitely was kind of nervous. I'm like, damn. Starting this shit all over again. So I remember the first time. We was all quiet and shit. We didn't really know each other. Yeah, at least we know each other now. Yeah, no, for sure. <laughs> well, look, I'm gonna get the uh, the elephant out the room. What, what is it? The elephant out the room? Nah, we're gonna address the elephant in the yeah, room. Yeah, address the elephant you in the room. You're gonna fuck a saying, though. If it's one thing you're gonna do, is fuck up a saying. Listen. I'm a little on. I ain't drink. I ain't drink like in a month, so I'm a little on and shit. Your this tolerance little, down. Yeah, tolerance low as shit. But I just wanted to say this though, like, we welcome used to back o- to another no, no, famous. No, 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 no. We used to oh. always say that welcome, like, welcome back to another famous podcast, one of the best upcoming podcasts on the planet. But we're gonna say welcome to the returning podcast, one of the best upcoming podcasts on the planet. I'm your host, Ant. We got Adi in the building, and we got Chris. So, y'all can't see him, but he here. Yeah, we got Chris in the back, and it's not Chris next door. It's my man right here. (laughs) But uh, this is the first episode of us returning, and obviously, y'all don't see Ryan, and y'all never saw uh, what Corey looked like. Oh, no, they did. They did? The one we shot, that one we did last year. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Damn. Yeah, y'all definitely did. But they not here, but they in good spirits, though. They definitely together is the blessing to continue, and um, that's what we're going to do. Shout out to my boys. They doing bigger and better things, though. I'm not going to say bigger because we're no, trying to be it? bigger with them, but I'm just saying that for their personal things, they doing good. They doing good in life. Yeah. And, yeah, I mean, shit, since the last time they, they seen a, a video from the channel, you boy, you wasn't in it. It was me and bro. Who? Oh, yeah. 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 So, I feel, you know what I'm saying? I got... got I the set. I don't know if that was coming out in the shot or not, but got to rep the team and shit. Um, no, we had a lot of obstacles during the, uh, the times we was apart. It was like a breakup. I ain't even going to hold you. It, we wasn't like bitter or nothing like that. Like it was also like, mutual shit. Yeah. You feel me? But we growing up, we'd be like, yo, hold on, hold on. Maybe, maybe it's something still there. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> Oh uh, shit! I, I but I mean for me it's like I'm the I'm the one that got broken up with. I'm the boy. I'm the I'm the guy in this yeah. shit. I'm like I'm trying to. Figure, I'm like yo, come on, yeah. come back. I'm yeah. I'm gonna be better. You know, <laughs> you know, you know when 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 the, when the guy go through the breakup, oh, he just go to the gym and start doing him, worrying about him and shit, and everything start going good for him. That's when she come back. Yeah. Nah, but <laughs> how, within them years, how you been though? Cause I ain't been that long. No, I've been long, bro. Well, no, I'm talking about since we was all together, like, like not, not since that last episode. I'm well, it's been like a year and a half. Yeah, yeah. It's just since, since then we just working, potting for for the rest of 23, then 24, the top of 24. You know what I'm saying potting with bro, and then um, as y'all can see, it's just me and Ant now. Um, Ron and Chris and good spirits. No, Corey. What did I say? I said Ron and Chris. Yeah. And Corey. All three of them in good spirit. They all yeah, doing yeah, good. Yeah, and doing right, good. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing good. good. I, but, you know, um, I do got, like, my, you know, my, then it's a little, it's, it's still kind of hard to say. Yeah, this shit, like, on camera and all this shit, it feel weird to talk about. But like I said, I got my brother on my shirt. For the people that was watching this and and keeping up with the with the pod and all that, he ended up, uh, he ended up passing away. He had a heart problem. <clears throat> um. And this time, you know when you think about some shit in the crib and you like, yo, how you gonna talk about it or whatever? It's the opposite of that. It's like you by yourself and you're in the crib and low-key, this is the crowd, though. Yeah. You feel me? Like, I ain't gonna lie, like, within them years, bro, like, you go through things like that. That shit hard, like, because it'd be random moments, bro. It'd be random moments. Yeah, bro, there's somebody, like, like I told y'all when we did the pod, yeah, it's like somebody bro. been in my life for a long ass mm-hmm. time, somebody to look up to. So then we end up doing a pod together. Now we talking every day. We we should we doing three, four pods yeah. a week, but we was working, bond, working. Yeah. So it's like it's shit tough to then the, the last day I seen him, we did three pods. It was a it was his birthday and shit. And you know, then a couple of days later he passed away. Damn. And then a couple of days later his second son was born. And this is all like in less than a week's man and shit. So it been real tough. I appreciate though, like all the people that's that's reached out, that's um Cause in these last what six months since February since the last episode dropped, 
been a lot of people that in person when they see me like, yo, we want we want you to get back to it. People to text me, DM me, all that kind of stuff. So I really appreciate that. Even for the people that don't watch it and the people that just fuck with me as and y'all know how much I really love this shit, how much I enjoy doing this shit. Um, yeah, it means a lot. Yeah, no, I ain't gonna lie. Speaking about like people hitting us up and shit like that. Like I was working downtown. A random car just stopped. <laughs> and I, and you, we live in Philly, so that shit happened, boy. It's bombed out. I'm like, I don't, I don't know who that, who in that car now like that. He's about to do the dash. No, nah, I'm looking, though, because at the end of the day, I'm making deliveries and shit for my job. Good looking. I'm making deliveries, so I'm like, fuck, so I'm kind of stuck. Then Bo put the window down. Like, y'all fuck with you, bro. I said, huh? <laughs> Pulled up to him and shit. He said, yeah, bro, I fuck with you. I'm Ron Fuchs. I fuck with y'all, man. I, I, I used to watch all y'all episodes this day and the third. I'm like, oh, all right, good looking. But that was like, what, two years ago? Basically? Yeah, two? from, from yeah, basically. So That's I'm cool. like, damn, people still holding on to shit like that. And I'm not saying we the biggest, because obviously we not. But it's just like even the little individual people that don't know me, that don't know me by my real name or shit like that. Like that's crazy, bro. Like, yeah, that that should mean a lot. Like when you when y'all stop us in the uh, in the street or whatever, like shit like that, just random messages and all that. That should mean a lot. Like, cause sometimes you don't, like you don't be expecting the shit, or nah, you don't bro. like, or sometimes it's a day where like, damn, you might be kind of like unsure about this shit. You'd be like, damn, this shit is hard. Like, bro, pause. you know, and you know why. <laughs> <laughs> you know why it's hard, pause, cause. Bro, like, while we juggling this, we also juggling our individual lives. And it's three people at that. Well, yeah, now it's three people. But three back people then on was camera. Four. Back then, yeah. Oh, it was five of us. Yeah, it was five of us, yeah. Like, it's just a lot, because you feel me? Like, but then this past, since the, the pie, like, I had another kid, another boy. And it's like, bro, whatever I thought I knew, appreciate that. Whatever I thought I knew about parenting. I ain't no shit compared to my my first son was easy as shit. Like he was easy, he was easy. He was slept overnight, no problems. You leave him in his swinger on his walker. He there all day chilling. The only reason he like cry or something like that was because he hungry or need or need sleep. But this one, bro, loose cannon. You remember the uh, Liza Thornberry? Nah, Chris, Chris, you know what I'm talking about Liza Thornberry. I don't know the young boy name, but he be like, dow, 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 dow. he be doing all this weird shit. Like he just where's bro, that from? Nickelodeon, you a young boy. That's why I keep forgetting. We, bro, all right, well, you're not going to get into it. Keep going. Nickelodeon, back in the day, the girl that used to uh, talk to animals. Bro, I know? just ain't have cable. We the same age. I just didn't uh, have we cable. Had, we had legal cable, like the little brown box. Yeah, I ain't had that shit. Oh, That's right, what I'm damn. saying. We the same age. Well, yeah. you like a year older than me, too. Yeah. But it's like, yo, he like that. He's just a wild. Like, Ted, the, the, from, from what was Looney Tunes? Yeah. He like that, bro. He be drawing. It's crazy, because they both look just like you, too. I mean, oh, yeah. they your sons, yeah, but, yeah. you know. It don't always be like that. It's, that's crazy. Yeah. Jack, congrats. I am. I got surgery too. I had a hernia oh, yeah, and yeah, shit. Yeah. I was fucked up for a minute. That's how you know we getting old, bro. <sighs> yeah. We start worrying about shit like that. Back then, we going to to that is physical only. Yeah, basically. And it's because we have to once a year for school, or we like trying to go on the and team shit. and yeah. shit. Yeah, that's a fact. Like people ain't want to go to no doctors. Well, I'm not even gonna say people. I just say men. I always say men because women like they get a knee scab, they going right to the joint. <laughs> Real shit, right to the clinic. <laughs> it's an emergency room. They'd they be like, you could have did that with Neil Sporin. They'd be like, no, I need a this, this, that, and a third, and a doctor's note. An MRI, work. I need yeah, all that. Like, next thing you know, she come out that joint talking about her blood, her blood sugars or whatever is low, high, or whatever. I'm like, the fuck? I thought you went in there for your knee. Like, yeah. you always finding out extra shit. But definitely, we do, we do, we should get physicals and shit check us more often though, at least once a year. We should. I ain't gonna lie. Like if you really, like, she look good on paper. You know when she look good on paper. <laughs> but yeah. when it's time to do it, we be scared. Like I ain't even gonna lie to you. Like, bro, the last thing you want to do is be like, all right, bet I'm cool. Let me just go in there. Then they tell you some shit. And that shit. Now you got that shit stressing you. Apart from what's stressing you already in your life, that yeah. shit on top now. But like the reason why we should though, like, cause I mean I ain't really getting into it. But with my brother, he had a heart problem. He thirty two, thirty three. He had to, he had the gym working out. Oh, shit. Shit. So he was like, uh, in, in like, a sense, he's in good shape. good shape. Yeah, yeah. so then it, it was real confusing. Like, yo, what the fuck? How you young and you in shape? You don't smoke, you don't, none of that extra shit. So it's like, you know, that, Dang, that shit crazy. Lie. You gotta that get checked. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, that shit is crazy. So it's like, you gotta, you gotta, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you get those checkups and all that shit. Yeah. Right? I mean, I've been getting more now because I had to get the surgery, but, yeah. you know. No, nah, I ain't gonna lie. Since you said that, bro, like, I've been seeing it, like, but then since COVID. People passing, but not really seeing, like they ain't get killed or nothing like that. They just pass for like medical reasons and stuff. And it's like you'll just assume because you don't really know. 
Yeah. You feel me? But that's crazy. You right. Absolutely right. So God. so I heard, so well, what was some of the predictions you feel like was what's different between now and then within us with with, with potting and stuff like that? Well, I mean, <clears throat> this is the first one. Um so we definitely this is our first time in this we got we in a new spot, we in a new studio. Um, with this one, I feel like, I don't know, I feel like we both, we comfortable, we like, we've been doing this for so long, even though, you know, you took a little break, so I took a little break, but it was, we've been doing this for so long, and like, we really want this shit type shit, so it's, I feel like we just gonna keep going, my, my predict, my two predictions, before the year over, we gonna be, we gonna, we had like 2k subs on you on YouTube right now, we gonna, we gonna get at least a five, I'm, five bands? Yeah, 5,000, before, oh, yeah, 5, the, before the year over. We in we in August right now, so I'm giving us four months to turn up to do some shit in four months that we that we ain't doing four years, but we, we came to work. Um, and my second prediction is Ron is gonna be back. I don't this know is- when I don't know about this year, but he gonna be back. That's my second prediction. Ew. That's my second one. I ain't gonna lie, like even coming over here, I thought I feel like I was being disloyal, just cheating on the nigga. I'm not, <laughs> like, like we not even, we not even on that type of time, but that's my brother, you feel me? So, I, but doing that without him and shit, I'm like, damn, bro, I'm doing something bad. Like, that shit crazy. But it's not, I, you know why I don't feel like that? Because it's not like we didn't tell him. Oh, no, it's, no, no, it's no. like, a, it's just life experience. No, 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 bro, listen, he's going through something right now. He just had a kid, you feel me? And he got a new job. I'm telling y'all, when y'all get kids, that shit gonna make, motivate y'all to do way better. So, I'm, y'all might be comfortable, y'all might be in a good stage in life. Once that kid come, wherever that good stage is, you feel like that's not enough. You need like ten times more. So I know he's juggling a lot. So that's why I ain't really tripping. Yeah, you feel me? And it's not like like it's he don't want us. He don't be like, oh y'all disloyal. Nah, hell no. Nah. You feel me? He just can't do it right now. You feel me? Maybe in the future. And I like that prediction though. I ain't even gonna hold you. But I'm not even gonna put that in the room because that's too much pressure. Well, yeah, but I don't feel like it's pressure. I just feel like they're going to see him sitting next to us eventually. He might not be full-time every day, like oh, every right, job, yeah, yeah. but oh, y'all yeah, going to yeah. see him like oh, with yeah, us. Yeah. You yeah, know, sure, it's, he's, sure. still, he's still co-host. He's still yeah. on the team. I feel like y'all know when y'all be seeing certain shows and shit like that, then the somebody not there, they really just stop fucking with them. Like, no, it's, <laughs> it's, it's not. It's never that. No, nah, no, nah, it's definitely not. But uh, What about you? Let me hear some of your predictions, some of your, your changes and stuff. No, nah, I just feel like... Like, within, like, working outside of this, because this is considered work, too. Working outside of this, this is something we want to do. We do the shit outside of work because we have to do, in a sense. You feel me? Yeah. But we trying to make this a, a full-time job. And if we can make this sense. a full-time job, bro, the sky's the limit. You feel me? So, that's one. Hopefully, by, I would say by the end of next year, we could some some way, somehow... I can see uh, us and be like, yeah, yeah, I just quit my job. This is gonna be my job. Yeah, that's if we if we keeping it a band. That's the goal. You that's definitely definitely the goal is to be able to be our own bosses and do the do shit our own way. Yeah, definitely and the goal. I ain't gonna lie, like this new studio, this shit a bonus. I ain't this shit was literally last minute type shit. Yeah, you feel me? And it's done tough. But uh, another prediction, I'll say, you say five k. I just feel like. That's too low, bro. Because I feel like, I, I don't know about y'all, but like me, like, but then when it comes with uh, social media and stuff like that, like, it's a lot of more people. I feel like back then when we first started, it was a lot of, like, haters. I don't feel like that no more. Like, I don't know if I'm, because I'm getting older, but everybody more genuine. I don't know, you know what, what so? I don't know what social media you consume, and you know I feel like so? there's way more hate right now, bro. You think so? Yeah, I personally like not to maybe necessarily not towards podcasters, but I just feel like in general, like it's just mad. Oh yeah, podcasters. Yeah, 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 just just but I'm saying like like the older I get, the I, the more I understand. Like people just just trying to live, do dumb. You feel me? Like carefree. Yeah. People ain't really trying to be doing shit. Then everybody, like you think about it, you could take your daughter to school, record a video or something. Your kid to school, record a video. And it'd be somebody in there be like, you only do that. You only uh, take care of your kid one with, with day a week. Like, bro, you don't even know me. <laughs> yeah. You feel me? Yeah. So, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's just probably because I'm getting older. But that's how I see it, bro. It's more love. Like, I'm going to definitely be showing out more love to other people. You, watch the, you know what I, what I think it is? You may, I think you just maybe less focused on it. Like, you care less about it. Like, the older you oh, get, you like, you like time, time going to keep rolling. Time going to keep rolling. So, it's like, and you having kids, like, you, your family growing. You know, you say you keep you keep into uh, life continuing. So, it's like, it's going to keep going. So, you got to do it or it's not going to get done. No, I ain't going to lie. I ain't even thinking about it like that. Right, yeah. right, you're right. You're right. 
Because, I, I mean, I'm telling you, I think you're funny than a whole lot of people. But you, we got to apply ourselves to the shit that, you know, we want to do or that we're good at or whatever. Nah, for sure. But, you know. Man. But it's hard to balance shit. Like, how we talking? It's... Bro, I'm telling you, like, this kid shit. And the thing is, bro, you watch, like, I ain't going to lie. Like, just how we was talking about, uh, like, other podcasts and stuff like that. I watch other podcasts and they talk about relationships. I'm like, damn, I ain't, I be sending it to my girl, like. I think we should do this. <laughs> Real so right. Like, ain't no. Listen, I'm not. I'm not like. I'm not. We we in a good space right now. But I'm just saying, like, you gotta like, still apply pressure. You feel me? Like, what you mean? Like, apply like new shit. Oh, and your relationship. Yeah, you saying like, try always get better. You feel me? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. For it's sure. Like a for basketball sure. career. If you can't shoot threes next season, get in the gym. Yeah, you got to get better per yeah, season. Yeah, yeah, that's a bro. that's a great mindset. You got to keep watering that plant. Yeah. Of the, of the relationship. Yeah, yeah, that's a good joint. Yeah, because when she when she leave outside them joints, she not in the crib no more. You feel me? The yeah. world be here. Damn, that shit sounded crazy. I ain't even. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say the world might really be here. <laughs> yeah, church, not wifey though. No, Please, no, you know. don't do that to me. Like I'm good people, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, hey, listen, I'm too good to be getting, be getting cooked like that. I can't be getting cooked like that, bro. Yeah. It's a scary I be crying with my kids and shit. Like, this shit crazy, bro. This shit crazy. <laughs> Yo, that TikTok you posted of uh, your son being a narc was the funniest shit I ever nah, seen in my bro, life, like, bro. Not in my life, but like in this nah, week. Nah, like, me, it's me crazy, stretch. right? Because I be seeing young boys too. Like, they be his age, but they don't act nowhere near like my son. And I'm not going to say my son like... Weird, he not weird. I just feel like he a young boy. Like but he got personality. You let him like explore. I let him be shit. him, bro. Like even yeah. the shit, I, bro. I be hating the cartoons he watch. Hating it because it don't even be cartoons. It be some YouTube shit. But I let him do him because I don't want to just force stuff on him. Like that's not cool. But anyway, he be like like recently he been started dressing himself. Like, like if we lay out clothes for him on his bed, he'll leave him and just pick out clothes like him. Huh. So wait, he I'm like um, he was on punishment. That, that when you seen that video, so he hasn't been out the crib for a couple of days. He was on punishment because he rolled on his wall. So, but uh, we we I went to go get a haircut. He's like, "Dad, can I come with you?" I'm like, "Come on." I'm in the car. He run down the steps and he get in the car and he closed the car and I look at him. He got a a, cat, a baseball cap with a with a regular gray t shirt and shit. I'm like, "Bro, you like a narc." Like. <laughs> <laughs> we should add that video to the to this. Uh, yeah, that joint funny. That should be though. funny. But I, f- I feel like you should put some some things on like your kids on to certain shit though. Oh yeah. I mean yeah. I like I don't got kids, but I'm just saying like there's definitely some shit that I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna just nudge it in their face a little bit more than other shit. Like I'm gonna let them be them, but you know I want you to to like certain stuff. Oh yeah, no, nah, but it, I I want to be like that, bro. But it's like like especially when he gets into sports, like he he just started playing flag football this summer, and bro, like I lied to you now, I never taught him nothing. Uh, he watched football when I watched football a little bit, but then he'll continue playing. Yeah, bro. When he stepped on that field and he got the ball, it's like he already knew what to do. Like he running, he running the ball and shit. Even though he went out of bounds, he wasn't letting people like get his flag. I'm like, yo, like I was hype as shit, and he was out of bounds. Like I was just hype as shit. <clears throat> yo, turn your mic a little bit. Like, yeah, yeah. But that that's tough though. Like that that gotta be a real dope like. Process. Just seeing, yeah, just seeing them like getting older and growing up. No, nah, I've been playing MOB. Like I've been getting back into baseball. Like, I've been playing MOB on the on the game. <laughs> no, nah, because I used to play baseball. Yeah, That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So like, you gonna play. put him in the baseball? Because no, no, so I be he, he, I be playing. So he was like, uh, Dad, can I play? And then I let him play. He be hitting home runs and shit against the computer. And I'm like, Damn, bro, you really alright? Then he's like, Dad, can I play? Like for real? Because I got a little cousin that play. Yeah. Like can I play with him? I'm like, Yeah, you for real? You really want to do it? He said, Yeah. Honestly, I would rather my son play baseball than oh, yeah. football. Personally, yeah. it's it's a little bit more bread. It's a little bit more bread, I think. And it's you gonna get less chance of you getting hurt. Yeah, 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 no, for sure, I know. I feel like that's a that's a dope job. And would you would you put your kids in like boxing or MMA? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, I want to. Word. Only because I I never, I never got to that. Yeah, and it's like really not that many people that know how to fight, but yeah, I mean, that yeah, shit is nowadays, crazy. You feel me? Yeah, now anybody know how to fight now. This shit, this shit crazy. Two, two, two. <laughs> get embarrassed out this bitch. That's why you can't be acting tough. Like motherfuckers be acting tough. With a lot of people get knocked out. You seen that that boy and the, the bus driver boy and that, that video that went viral. I think it was like yesterday, two days ago. Whatever. The bus driver boy beat up somebody on the bus. I think it was out Jersey. Oh no, no, I ain't that even see that. Crazy. The boy was I thought you were talking about the bus driver. He was mid route and he stopped and went to Wendy's to take like a bathroom break. Oh yeah, yeah, and, I seen and, that. And the lady in the bus, she was snapping like, "I'm late for work. This is what we do." This That's some Philly shit right there. Yeah, it was. It was in Philly for sure. Yeah. I seen that. 
Oh man, um, I don't know. If, if, is anything else you wanna you wanna add or to this one? I think we we can wrap this one up in a little bit. Um, I feel like this uh, this our first episode back. We just wanted to to give y'all like a recap and let um, y'all know that we coming back. Well, this is uh, this is us being back. When, when oh, see, see, yeah, 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 yeah. At this point, once y'all see this episode, at that point, it's it's consistency. After that, yeah. we gonna keep we gonna try to uh, drop at least once a week. Uh, like this, and then uh, we'll see what what else we could we could do. Um, but yeah, we definitely like I definitely want to try to give y'all as much content as we could give y'all. Um, let us know in the comments um, if there's anything y'all y'all want us to talk about, any particular topics, anything y'all yeah, want to hear. That shit over here, bro. Yeah, I need advice in our relationships. I feel like we in the older space. We we almost in, in our thirties and shit like that. So we more chill. You be out. I be seeing you all. You been outside lately? Yeah, yeah. yeah I, congratulations, my yeah. brother. I'm chilling a little bit. Hey, good spirits. I, I, I see yeah, the crowd good. though, so that's what I'm seeing. Like I be seeing the crowd and shit. I'm like the crowd. Hey. What you mean? Yeah, behind you and shit. I be seeing the the little eyes behind and shit. I be seeing. Uh, it. Ah, my little good. man doing his thing. He growing up on us. Yo. I was. I, that's funny. I was thinking the same thing about you. I'm like, yo, he, my my boy, a changed man. <laughs> From the, go back a couple of years. Oh no, somebody told me the same shit the other day. They like, man, they like, yo, I could, I could really see your growth from the first season to now. Da, da, da. And I was like, damn. They buddy. got me holding the Bible and shit now. Like, <laughs> be, be preaching, bro. Tell you, but now nah, I feel I'm the same. I just, it just like, I know, I know, like I. Had, with that time off too, like it was more so like uh what's this shit called? Um when you clearing your mind, what's that shit called? Clearing your mind. All right, clearing your mind. <laughs> like focusing on the important things instead of like the little bullshit. Like, I ain't even gonna lie to you. Like Word. But Oh, you know what before sorry, you no, no, no. <clears throat> I was thinking of before before we wrap up this uh this episode. Cause we cause we've been talking about this for for a few months now or whatever. Yeah. Um and I don't know, I just had some shit on my mind. What to ask you? Like, how, how long you been wanting to get back to this? Or like, what made you like hit me up? Like, yo, we should get back to this type shit. Uh, I ain't even gonna lie. So I be working, right? Yeah. And I be on the phone with my coworkers. Like, like it's like we like truckers. Like, you know how truckers be on the phone all day? Yeah, y'all motherfucker. I, I, I don't know how. Yo, y'all talk to everybody. Y'all call, Facetime everybody. No, y'all got who? the truckers, bro. They oh, be no, like, no, no, no. people on the bro, phone. I lost, you know, I talk to two, three people max every day. Word. And bro, I ain't even gonna hold you. Like, not even my girl. We be on the phone this long. Like, I be looking at the car. I be six hours <laughs> with dudes. Dudes. <laughs> hey yo. Like no, no. You diddy be six shit. hours with dudes. <laughs> yeah, no hey, diddy yo. shit. But like, it, bro, I lost you. Know, that's the only way. Like, the work gonna it's not gonna seem like as work. You feel me? Because you on the phone have like talking yeah, to your, your friends and shit. But I'm talking to them, and I we just be bidding all day, bro. And I be having people cracking the fuck up. I'm like, yeah, hey, let me get back to this, bro. I need to get back on this, bro. Like they be telling me, like, bro, you funny as shit. You got to do this, this, and the third. I'm like, yeah, bro. I got to get back to it. And a lot of people been telling me, too. So it's just like, why not? Right. I mean, I ain't, I wouldn't even ask you that because you so, you always wanted to do this anyway. Yeah. But. I ain't going to lie. I'll keep it a bean with you. You ain't asking me, but fuck it. I'll share. I, I ain't going to lie. I was about to get this shit up, bro. Like, like a couple months ago when we talked and shit, bro. I'm gonna keep it a bean. I put all, all the equipment up for sale and everything. I was like, man, like this shouldn't even feel right. Like I man. didn't, I felt like I like, like I yeah, lost. Yeah, I don't understand. Like I don't know. I know y'all probably seen that meme where with a hood bankruptcy is like if somebody said a P five. <laughs> he sell this. That means that's it. Like that shit done. Yeah. Not saying you broke. I'm just saying like you really was gonna give it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I get the. I get what you was trying to say. Uh, yeah, nah, bro. I feel like I like I lost a love for this shit, bro. And then I don't know. It just time just kept passing and shit, and I'm like, I feel just everything I, in my life, I feel like kept pushing me back to this type shit. Maybe that was the way that I interpreted it, yeah. type shit. So, you know, I but mean, yeah, I, I feel, I'm happy as shit to be doing this. Shit. I don't know I'm me. a lot less nervous. Like I'm not nervous at all. I thought I was gonna be a little bit more. You no, know nah, I just feel like I feel like I'm not nervous. I just feel like, you know, when you rusty. That's what it is. Yeah. I'm definitely rusty and shit. You get back on the ball court. You ain't been on the ball court for two years. You know how I play, but. You ain't switching a lot of shit. You just gotta see that bitch go in once or yeah. twice, and from there you like, like, okay, ain't that bad. Like, bull scored twenty on me, but, but but I was still on the game. I ain't get fouled out and like that. We got, yeah, for sure. But um, yeah, I think we could we could wrap it up here and shit. I don't know if anything else you, you want to add, Chris. Anything you want to add to this shit? Good. Have us on the socials. Hopefully we're gonna put it down here. I don't know how this shit work yet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What what had this though? That that is one thing. Um, this is not the finished product. But it's it's this is the the process the journey like I y'all been on on this journey with us for four years, and it's gonna be a lot more years. So you know shit is gonna be ever changing and growing. So this ain't the this ain't the final uh edition, but you know we'll keep working. Good, we out of here.
I thought Chris was gonna do something. Yeah, he start, he, said, he like he was about to start breakdancing yeah. or some shit. Okay, Olympics breakdancer, I hear you. <laughs> but, uh, it's never famous. Welcome back to another famous podcast. My fault for cutting you off. I ain't know who was gonna do it. You good? Welcome back to another famous podcast. We're gonna keep trying to give y'all the best content that we can, and um, enjoy y'all weekend or y'all week. Hit the subscribe. Deuces.